He is known for his career as a musician and composer in Germany and Russia. He was active in the Helsinki Philharmonic Society and later moved to Moscow. His name is Vasily Brandt. In the world of music, there are those whose talent and passion transcend borders and leave an indelible mark on the industry. One such legendary figure is Vasily Brandt, a renowned musician and composer. Born and educated in Coburg, Germany, Brandt's musical journey began in the late 19th century. After honing his skills in the spa orchestra in Bad Oenhausen and the Helsinki Philharmonic Society, Brandt's name started to gain recognition. His time in Helsinki, under the guidance of Robert Kajanis, proved to be a pivotal experience that shaped his musical style and technique. In 1890, Brandt made a significant decision that would change the course of his life. He moved to Moscow, Russia, and adopted the name Vasily Georgievich. This move marked the beginning of a new chapter in his career, as he immersed himself in the rich musical culture of Russia. But it was the opening of the Saratov Conservatory in 1912 that truly cemented Brandt's legacy. Drawn to Saratov, he would spend the rest of his life there, dedicating himself to his music and teaching the next generation of musicians. Despite his limited command of the Russian language, Brandt's musical prowess and dedication spoke volumes, often relying on demonstrations to convey his musical instruction. Sadly, Vasily Brandt's life was cut short on February 2, 1923, reportedly due to a vaccination. But his contributions to the world of music continue to resonate. Brandt's compositions and teachings have left an enduring impact on the field, inspiring countless musicians and shaping the very fabric of musical expression. In the late 19th century, Vasily Brandt's talent on the trumpet was recognized by the prestigious Bolshoi Theater in Moscow. He joined the theater as principal trumpet in 1890 and later became the first cornet in 1903. His performances captivated audiences and his skill on the instrument was unmatched. In addition to his work at the Bolshoi Theater, Brandt was appointed as the second-ever trumpet professor at the Moscow Conservatory in 1900. This was a significant achievement, as he followed in the footsteps of Theodore Richter, a renowned trumpet player. Brandt's expertise extended beyond performance as he also taught band orchestration at the conservatory. Brandt's involvement in the music community extended beyond his roles at the theater and conservatory. He was an active member of the Russian Musical Society and frequently toured with a brass quartet, consisting of members from the Bolshoi Theater. Their performances showcased the brilliance of Brandt's trumpet playing and further solidified his reputation as a prominent musician. In 1912, Brandt embarked on a new chapter in his career when he joined the faculty of the newly established Saratov Conservatory. He became the first professor of trumpet at the conservatory and also took on the responsibilities of managing and conducting the conservatory orchestra. Brandt's teaching approach was influenced by the Arban Method, a renowned trumpet teaching technique, as well as his own compositions. Do you want to explore more composers? Who do you want to see featured next? Subscribe and leave a comment below to let me know. I'll see you in the next video.